Eh, qué rollo, quiero mandar un saludo a mi amigo Goodfella, de parte de tu amigo Jaime Munguía. Un abrazo que no me animo. All right, man. Clarissa Shields defeats Emma Cozen. Uh, ten round unanimous decision. She did lose a second in the fight. She did get head butted at the end of the. Um, she got head butted at the end with a, with a nick on her at the end of the, the tenth round. Well, in the tenth round, Let's talk about it. Savannah Marshall jumped. They had her come in and um, they got into like a little argument. Well, I wouldn't say a little argument. <laughs> It got kind of vulgar, Carissa. I guess it was time to put the camera on to build the fight. Um, but uh, yeah, Emma Cozen, she came in. We talked a little bit about her on live last week. Uh, she came in and um, undefeated, had one draw, and uh, she fought. She couldn't hit Carissa. You know, at the end of the day, it was like it was like putting a. <laughs> well, apparently, old girl went to sleep. We get there, but. Um, uh, Savannah Marshall was sleep ringside, and uh, basically it was just pretty much, you know, uh, Cozen came and backed up in the first round. That was it. After that, Carissa started pushing her back, and she was unsure. Carissa was real slippery. I thought she was very sharp. Uh, we got to remember she just fought MMA, what, December, November-ish. She was very sharp. Um, and the first thing you think about watching, shout out to Caroline Du Bois, Dan Du Bois, younger sister. She's like the boxing prodigy of the family. She's probably the best one. Uh, one thing you watch, watching their fights, they kind of look like a mirror image of each other. But one thing you don't see, you know, that one thing you think about when watching them is boxing. Like, bro, why can't we three minutes? <laughs> mm -hmm. That's the first thing you think of. You're like, man, why this just can't be three minutes? And if it could be three minutes, then we probably have a different, uh, more stoppages. You know, but um, for the most part, Shields was fast. Uh, she was sharp. Um, she was she was a little bit more patient than usual, right? She said they was working on calming down, picking her shots. She a little bit more patient than usual, bro, uh, in this fight. And um, uh, she picked her shots. Hand speed looked good, sharp. She looked like she in her prime. But I think she rushed it because she only got two minutes to get the stoppers. Now, she said that was a lot of times in this fight where they should have stopped the fight. I didn't agree with that. I thought, oh, girl, took the punishment well. Was it some times where she nodded off a little bit? Yeah, but, you know, she was, you know, you know, she just didn't continue to put her foot to the metal uh, the right way. And that was just pretty much the fight. It was just her beating on old girl, old girl taking the beating. She was did what she posted. She went to the body. <laughs> Um, she picked her shots. This old girl was tough. It just, to me, the two minute rounds make it tough for some, a girl or woman with Clarissa Shields po uh, power, you know, but this was, uh, uh, Savannah Marshall only, well, she beat a uh, Chris in the amateurs. So this was Savannah Marshall, um, watching the fight, going to sleep, man. At the end of the day, I mean, Emma should have brought a little bit more to the table. But at the same time, um, you got to credit Carissa Shields. Um, but at the end of the day, you know, at the end of the day, it was just, you know, she just don't have a, the type of punching power that uh, she don't have the type of punching power to turn out, to turn off somebody lights in two minutes. You know, if you give her three minutes, maybe this fight would have been over eight, nine rounds, even the 10 rounder. But the extra minute. It matter. You say, okay, it's 10 extra minutes on the fight. 10 extra minutes. It was a lot of chances where, like I said, old girl was nodding off. She wouldn't have made it 12. And I think conditioning would be a big thing, too. Conditioning would be huge. You know, a lot of these women, they only got to go 10. In two minutes, 10, 20 minutes, you know, 30. You know, should they go 36? Well, that's up to somebody else to figure out should they go 36. But was it the most exciting fight in the world? Absolutely not. <laughs> I ain't going to lie to you. Absolutely not. It wasn't the most exciting fight. Maybe somebody, you know, like Savannah Marshall can push Corsair to do something different. You know, but today, defensively, man, this is like one of the uh, – this is like one of the more – her more polished performances, to be honest, as far as how sharp she was. Um, yeah, this is one of her most polished performances, to be honest, man. She was she was she was sharp. She was uh she was defensive responsible this fight. She fought under I thought she fought more patient than she usually do. Um 
So yeah, she she to me she this is one of her more her most other than uh uh the old girl that everybody's trying to hype up that beat her. It was uh Chris, Christina Hammered. I mean that was that was probably her best performance, but right up there is this one. You know, you see she's starting to creep into her prime. You see it, it's starting to happen. So if they give her a three minute round, it's gonna be interesting. I mean, she really can establish herself as the greatest woman of all time, but her and uh, her and old girl Savannah Marshall got into it, and uh, uh, like I said before, apparently Savannah Marshall got a, a fight coming up in uh, March 12th, and she got to win her March 12th fight, and then apparently they're gonna be looking to fight Gordon, whoever that was, her manager, promoter. They're gonna be looking to fight uh, in June, so um, it's gonna be interesting. Savannah Marshall is 11 and 0. But no draws, nine knockouts. Uh, so I don't. Even, uh, she she got a WBO world title. She got a, you know obviously she pretty big girl. You know five eleven and a half. She fighting that middleweight. You know Chris had been up a little a little higher. She thirty years old. So you know she can crack a little bit. So she kind of can mess Clarissa Shields physical kind of physically. She like she literally like what is it, about three and a half inch taller if these listings are right. So. She taller than her, so it's gonna be interesting. She a lot. She four years older than her, and at one point, Mayweather did sign her, and then sign Christian Shields. And they from they from the same state. You know, you had to do Flint from uh, Grand Rapids. I don't think it's that far. It's, this is an hour. I'm in Detroit. It's an hour. It's an hour to get to Flint. It's about two and a half, three to get to Grand Rapids. I could be wrong on that. I've been to Grand Rapids in like over ten years, so it's two uh, hour thirty nine minutes to get to. Uh, from Flint to Grand Rapids right now on a Saturday. I don't think too much moving on a Saturday. And just for just for uh just for uh information from Detroit to Grand Rapids is two hours and twenty minutes. I know it's something like that. Cause I like going to Birch Run. Birch Run is a pretty good night, little fashion strip, Nike outlet. That was the only Nike like store in the air, like in the state. <laughs> you had to go to Chicago to go to one, I believe. But that's how back in the day when I was younger, I got that's where I got the first LeBrons at. I used to be a LeBron fan when I was real young, but uh, younger. But, you know, at the end of the day, bro, they got into a little shout match. And Carissa, she said something. She said Carissa Shields couldn't really do nothing with her. And Carissa didn't hear her. They announced it to her. And then they started getting to the shout match. Carissa started saying, you can't wipe my butt. You can't wipe my draws. And like I said before, they're trying to build it up. And I'm going to talk about this probably tomorrow, by why some boxers got to go abroad. She reaches progress, have to go to Dubai. Um you know, Carissa Shields having to go over to the UK to reestablish herself, try to establish herself as a star. Terrence Crawford, if you could be going to Dubai, I do Jack went over to Dubai, Dubai, and Grigandau fighting Dubai pretty soon. A lot of these, some of these fighters have to go to Dubai to try to establish new fan bases. And like I said before, I think it's be an interesting video. But Shields wins ten round, then use a second, a millimeter, a millisecond of the fight. But hey, let me know what you girls and guys think. Check the fight reaction playlist for more videos like this. Thumbs up the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel, and subscribe button, the bell icon button. Hit all notifications, increase your chance notification to go live or drop a video. Um, want to financially support the channel? Cash up, dollar sign, CJ Good 313, Venmo, CJ Good 313, PayPal link in the description. Best with donate, just comment, thumbs up, subscribe to the channel for your boy, and subscribe button, the bell icon button. Hit all notifications, increase your chance notifications. Check the fight reaction playlist and women boxing playlist. Peace.